Season 14 of American Idol is in the books, and we have with us today Clark Beckham, ladies Yay. and gentlemen. Hey, the winner of American Idol Season 14 is. Nick Fradiani. Nick is your new American Idol. Are you sad that you didn't win? Um, no, I'm not. Uh, initially, of course, of course. Uh, it was weird, you know. It was a, a wave of emotions. I, I felt the honestly the first thing that went in my head when he said Nick's name was like. Oh, I'm Clay Aiken. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. I, and I and I was like, oh shoot! And you know, to see then the Coronation song, and but then very very quickly, I mean, within a matter of seconds, I I just was, and you can kind of see it on. Uh, I think if you watch back, uh, if initially I'm like, oh dang it, and then I just I get so happy for Nick, and that sounds so cliche. And so, like, oh, sure you were. But I really, 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 really was. We've lived together in the same hotel for, you know, ten, five, five months. <laughs> right, five months a long we've, time. We've been together. And the contestants, like, pair off as friends. They're saying, okay, I'm closer to this guy. Is it because you actually share, like, a, a, a bedroom together or sure. a room? So yeah, roommates. Your yeah. roommate was? Rayvon. Okay. Rayvon Ray was my roommate since Top 48. So a lot of others, you know, their roommate would get cut. And then they'd have to switch with someone else, and they get cut. They have to switch. But Rayvon was my roommate the entire time. Uh, when Rayvon got cut, we all had separate rooms. We moved to hotels, and it was, so it was. Rayvon is made of rubber because that, that guy kept bouncing back. <laughs> I mean, how did he even keep? You know, his he always had a smile on his face, and he was always like at the bottom two. And they had the weird Twitter thing. You had five minutes yeah. to vote on Twitter. Yeah, and you had these two people's fate in your hands. And Rayvon just kept winning the he Twitter votes. He should be votes. called Savon. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Really right. should. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he. It's funny. We call him just the undefeated Twitter champion. I mean, he he says he's gonna he says he's gonna get like a a tattoo of the the Twitter bird. And, uh, <laughs> just, uh, yeah, he's he's uh, he's the man. Did you guys find out um, obviously that oh, you were doing the show when you found out that American Idol only has one more season left? Yeah. So it was to make the season that you're on the, the next to last season even more special. Going, I'm glad I got in when I did because it's over. Yeah, and, you know, it was kind of like, okay, we, we really got to make this good because Idol is really, um, you know, I mean, four months ago I was I was literally playing on the street begging for people to look at me. And now I'm in here with you guys, these cool little light-up. <laughs> <laughs> Where's hometown again? White House, Tennessee, just north of Nashville. You know where, where Eric's from Tennessee? Eric. from Murfreesboro. Are you really? Yeah. That's he used to sing brilliant. on the street, too. Just on the other <laughs> side. Yeah, he was a... And look where I am. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I when I was in Nashville and I'd play on the street, there'd be a lot of times they just want to hear a country song, and I don't know a lot of country music. i just sing Let's Get It On, like on repeat. <laughs> um, but someone would come and uh, someone someone would say, after like midnight or so and they're already i mean they're wasted mm -hmm. and one woman said play me that play me that hide and seek in the dark song and i'll give you twenty dollars <laughs> and i was like i i and i'm thinking i have no idea what that song is but of course i was like oh yes ma'am right up <laughs> right, I, just started, right up. <laughs> I just started playing like you and me uh fishing in the dark uh, twinkle little star <laughs> i just started i just started singing a random thing and she was like that's my chance. <laughs> and, we, we and she didn't even realize she gave me a fifty dollar bill. Wow. And I was like, you know, praise the Lord. <laughs> thank, thank you for you. your donation. So, what is the next uh, plan for uh, Clark Beckham? Uh, I don't know. Whatever people tell me to do. I'm well, yeah, kidding. he's very no, busy no, no, right no. now. Right? You got a uh, yeah, schedule and got, everything. Now you've got people. Right, you got people. <laughs> um, you know, I'm I'm just gonna keep doing what I've always done. I'm I'm gonna keep practicing and and diving into music, into the center of it, you know, and into, you know, the the music that is kind of, I guess, uh, at the center most part of my core, you know, and, and be able to develop that more and more. You know, I've told people I'm, I'm addicted to music and I'm uh, truly, I'm addicted to hard work. If I'm not working hard at something, I feel really uncomfortable and I don't know 
what I'm doing. I guess those are two good addictions to have. <laughs> they, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> no I'm one's going to have an intervention and go, you listen, right. Clark, uh, your hard work is affecting us in the following ways. We really want you to cut it out. Yeah, <laughs> You're making but... us look bad. Do you have your go-to song that uh, you want to make a woman fall in love with you? You know, there's always, I mean, you, you, know, you being the guitar I've, player. I've recently wrote a song on like what I think, and it's almost kind of like tongue-in-cheek, kind of quirky, but and what I think would be the, the, the perfect girl. For me, but I, I, that's one of my favorite songs to play. Can you look in Heidi's eyes what? and just sing her something like a pal? Like, make her fall in what love with you, What is that song called? Uh, it's called When Will You Fall For Me. Oh, my God. I gotta look. And it's on iTunes? No, I just wrote it. So maybe Clark. that'll be Come on, on Clark. The... Sing it and ruin her chair. I want to her ruin her chair. No, no, what we really want to hear, we want to hear, we have every single time we have an idol contestant in here, we have you guys sing your version of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Twinkle Twinkle. Everybody. Okay. Make it your own. I've got, let me tell you, can I tell you a quick done. story? Of course. This is, this is funny. You know when I sang Your Man on the show mm-hmm. and Scott was like, you're on your fast way, you're on a fast track to Holiday Inn, that's horrible, you sound like a lounge player. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> uh, and then I just stuck with it, you know, and I sang Your Man and then the next week was his pick, you know, he got to pick for me and he sent me an email joke. He said, uh, he said, because of, you know, what you put me through last week, your song that I picked for you is Twinkle, Twinkle, Little. <laughs> <laughs> so that's funny that, that, that you said that. So did you uh, instantly write back and say, JK at the end, or you start preparing it? <laughs> well, like, I no, just, no, I was totally I, kidding. I, I, knew you, I knew he was kidding, but then I emailed back. I was like, hey, man, I, I know you're kidding, but if you want, I'll, I mean, I'll kill it. <laughs> I'll, get you, I'll, I'll find something, man. I'll give you the, the, the sickest. Uh, arrangement of that song you've ever heard, man. I'll, I'll you know, I'll, we'll make it happen. Well, you could you could win the Dish Nation Twinkle Twinkle Idol because, like I said, the uh, several uh, several contestants come through here and they've all sang this oh, that gosh. first line of it. So that's um, weird. I'm so nervous. <laughs> he wasn't nervous just last the, first the finale. Line, just Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. How I wonder where you, where what where you are. What uh, you what, are. what you are. Right. It's interpretation. I wonder what he can do. Whatever you what you are. Up above, the world Up above the like a diamond. Rolled so high, like a diamond. Oh, in the sky. Okay, this, this is the first line. You got it. You got it. Ready? Yeah, Clark, yeah, okay. back up, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I wonder where you are. Okay, that's it. Okay. Oh my God. Oh gosh, I'm nervous. <laughs> twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder where you are. I won't keep going. Up above the clouds, world's world so high. Like a diamond in the sky. Oh, my God. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder where you are. Oh, oh, oh my God. He wins. Oh, yeah, he, he wins. wins. <laughs> That's so good. Clark Beckham, everybody. Wow, we that nice. was awesome. Yeah. I couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Yeah, I was like, yeah, Diamond <laughs> World, <laughs> what? It's a new game like Twinkles. singing charades. <laughs> you have to sing your guests. I love yeah, it. it's awesome. Yeah. Thanks for coming in, Clark. You can be sure and check out Clark's new album when he puts it out. <laughs> <laughs> Clark Beckham, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yeah. Thanks so much, guys. Oh, I remember the first time I subscribed to a YouTube channel. It was so romantic. I um I stayed up all night just watching video after video. So subscribe to uh, our channel, okay? Just click my button right here. Right there. We'll watch videos all night long. It's me and you.